Oh no, now Mika's gonna bite the prince. What is going on? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to the Disney Princess Challenge episode two. We are back in Willow Creek at the Evil Queen's house. But first of all, I have decided to change the rules that we are playing with because I got talking to a, another simmer who is also doing this challenge. Her name is JPS14 and she is also doing this challenge. So go ahead and hop on over to her channel and check her challenge out. But I didn't know this, but there are actually revised rules for this challenge. So there are updated rules. We have only done episode one so going forward i think we are going to be playing with the revised updated rules and the reason that we are going to be doing that is because i took a look at the rules and they are much more detailed they seem much more challenging i just think it will be much more fun for us and this challenge and the channel if we played with the rules that were a little bit more challenging so let's pop over and take a look at the rules now Okay, so here we are with the revised rules. These updated rules are by Melanoi. Melano, sorry if I'm saying that wrong. Um, but obviously all credit goes to Miss Playin for the original Disney Princess Challenge. Okay, so basically guys, it is the same rules. They have just added some more stuff. So we've got Snow can work from home as a freelancer. She can only marry after the last dwarf is born. The last female dwarf born will be Cinderella. And we have must befriend a flock of birds and at least one rabbit. So that tells us that when Snow runs away, she should be living in Henford on Bagley. So as you can see, it is very similar, basically the same, just a few extra things added to do with her career and her aspiration. And I will be linking these rules in the description going forward. Okay, so let's hop back into the game. Here we are with Snow White. She is being a big lazy bones and she is still in bed. But really we need to get her to go to her first day of school. It is Monday and it's gone 8am. She should have already <laughs> gone. It is saying that she's on vacation for five days. I'm not sure if that's a holiday in the safe file. Like, I don't know what that's about. But I want her to go to school. Oh, wow. Did you see the bills? They were like 10k. So here Snow comes. She is just heading off to school right now. And she's Snow White, so she's probably not going to learn much. She is probably just going to... I don't want to say make friends, because Snow White is not supposed to make friends. But the prince is a teen and I think he goes to school too, so that might get up our friendship with him. Okay, so whilst Snow White is at school, I think we are going to get the evil queen and we are going to get her to head off to the realm of magic because she really wants to increase her power. She wants to be the most powerful queen in all of the land and beautiful, but she's not. But she probably thinks that the more powerful that she gets, the more beautiful and she can make a spell to make herself younger and more beautiful than Snow White, who actually is the fairest in the land. <laughs> okay, so let's wake up the evil queen and get her to head to the magic realm. Here we go. <laughs> okay, so here we are at the magic realm. And I think we're going to get the queen to go ahead and learn some new spells and become even more powerful. So we're going to try and find the, the sages, they're called sages, it's called, called the mages. This is the sage, oh they are sages. This is the sage of mischief magic. And I think we need to go a little bit more evil than mischief because it is the evil queen untamed magic this has got to be it so the evil queen wants to know all the most powerful people and the most evil people and untamed magic is where it's at so i'm gonna get her to ask for magical training she wants to learn the naughtiest spells from the most powerful person so here we go she is teaching her some naughty magic but i don't know why the queen is standing here and the sage is over here 
but she is teaching her some pretty evil magic right now. I wonder what evil tricks she's learning and I wonder if when she gets home after she's had her fun at the magic realm whether she will be testing these naughty spells out on Snow White. I mean I hope not but she is pretty evil and the evil queen is getting quite hungry so I think after this little spell learning session we'll get her to go and get something to eat. Oh, Snow White is back home from school, so we will get her to head home probably after this. What did we learn? Anything? We didn't learn any new spells? No? Oh, I think I clicked the wrong thing. I've just asked her to teach us untamed magic. Hopefully that won't take too long. Because the Queen knows Snow White is home from school and she wants to get back and basically torture, torture. her. <laughs> the Queen's like going to cook some food. How are you going to... She's like, no, I don't do that. I don't cook the food. I order the food. Dude, are you going to learn this untamed magic or what? Come on. What's going down? Magic town. Here we go. Oh, and that was very quick. The queen has discovered a new spell. Necrocall. Untamed magic. Necrocall. Necro summon, summon the, the dead, dead from, from their, their final, final resting place. place. Well, she can't use that on Snow White because Snow White is very much alive and she's very much staying that way. Thank you, Mrs. Evil Queen. Let's see if we can learn a different spell off one of the other sages. Where are they? Yes, right, we found this one here. I think this is gonna be practical magic though. And he looks kind of mad. I don't think we know this guy. Oh, we do know this guy. Asked to teach practical magic. Oh, mischief, because maybe she could teach us a really mischievous spell that we could use on Snow White later on. Uh, so the Queen just learned how to keep your plants healthy and bug free. That doesn't really suit her. But we're going in for the mischievous spell now. Desperio. Fill a sim's mind with feelings of intense sadness. Yeah that sounds like something she would definitely use on Snow White. She is that evil. Anyway I think that's enough learning magic for one day. She is even more powerful than when she left the house so well the castle so she is gonna head home now okay so here we are back at the house with snow white she is just doing a little bit of cleaning here but i have noticed that it is a cozy up day so i think we are gonna get snow white to call the prince and arrange to meet him somewhere where there's a bonfire and we can cozy up with the love of our lives prince charming okay so travel okay so where is gonna have a bonfire bridgerton bay isn't part of the save file that we're in but i think we're just gonna head over to this park anyway because snow white loves the animals and it's dog friendly because i think it's autumn so there should definitely be some leaf piles that we could set on fire <laughs> we're just straight up arsonists now that's us okay so here we are at the park here we are with prince charming i'm guessing these guys are both very tired because <laughs> they don't look happy okay so where's the leaf piles there are none okay so i'm gonna go ahead and okay so i just went ahead and put a fire down <laughs> so we're gonna get snow to come and light the fire oh she's over there chatting to the prince okay snow's light in the fire Yay! She did it! Okay, and then we are gonna add log for the fire to go out. <laughs> and we can roast marshmallows. Hopefully the prince will come and sit with us. Oh, look at this little doggo! Hey! Oh! This is Mika! Hi Mika! How cute! Oh, here comes the prince and Mika. We're all having a lovely time together. Oh, and this person too. <laughs> No, go away. Go away. <laughs> oh no, now Mika's gonna bite the prince. What is going on? Aw. Okay, so we have completed cozy up day, but how can we cozy up a little bit more? Oh, she dropped her marshmallow. <laughs> oh, Prince Charming is loving this. He shows signs of the lover personality. Ooh, Prince. Oh no, Mika is barking at us. What's going on? I think we should try and make friends with Mika cautious introduction snow do it because you absolutely love animals do a cautious introduction with this cute little doggo that doesn't seem to be with anyone it might be with this sim over here 
are and I think these guys are just getting to know each other and Snow is burning herself on that marshmallow really badly <laughs> but I think she's just you know getting to know the prince having a little flirt with him getting to know him she's probably opening up about her living situation with the evil queen her evil stepmother Oh, and again, it's telling us that he's a hero. We know he's a hero and he's a lover. Like, he is the perfect man for us. Oh, and Snow just came over here to cook something using a little bit of the Evil Queen's money up, which she might be aware of and get really mad about. We don't know, so. Oh, and I think the prince is leaving. <laughs> the Evil Queen will soon have her period, okay. <laughs> she gonna be getting mad guys <laughs> okay I'm guessing Snow White is really hungry so she's gonna eat some of this and then she is super tired so we will get her to head home oh my gosh it is gone midnight the evil queen is gonna be so mad with us you should go Snow go home run quickly before she finds out if she hasn't already found out you need to go I know you've half eaten your burger and that's a sad state of affairs, but needs must. Oh, here she goes really sad because she knows she's going straight back to that evil queen. Okay, so Snow White is home now, but she is going to have to tread very carefully because the evil queen is going to be mad. Okay, is she mad? Oh, well, I think uh, the queen is mad with snow she seems to be shouting at her here i think she's like what time do you call this snow how very dare you and you spent some of my money what were you spending money on and how dare you leave this house you should be here cleaning and making me some food and i think so it's like i have a life too i could do stuff that i want oh this is getting pretty heated guys yeah the evil queen seems pretty mad <gasps> Oh my god, she just threw a drink in her face. Oh, she is still shouting at her about this. Oh my god, what is she doing? <gasps> she just put, she just did something to Snow White. Days, foggy mind from deliriate spell. Wait, what was I doing? That was really mean. She doesn't even care, look. She's so happy with herself. Evil, lady, evil. Okay, so where is Snow? <laughs> She's wandering aimlessly. She's gonna end, where is she? She's gonna end up <laughs> getting herself run over or something. We need to just, okay, let's get Snow to bed. It's three o'clock in the morning anyway. Come on, Snow, up to your little attic room. And hopefully she'll be okay finding her way back home. Oh wow, that queen is really mean. And here a very, very dazed Snow White goes to sleep for the evening and we'll leave her here and catch you guys in the morning okay so it is the next day but snow is just heading out to school here uh, it has started snowing and now it stopped <laughs> and snow is pretty tired so i think we're gonna get her to sleep in class because she's not that bothered about learning stuff anyway Oh, and the school has phoned the evil queen. Oh, no. See, they're reporting Snow White to the evil queen thinking, oh, her parent will sort her out. But they don't realise that she's just going to put a nasty evil spell on her. And this isn't making Snow White's home situation any better. And it says, a teacher had to break up a fight between Snow and another student in the hall today. What should we do? So the queen's just like, have them work it out. But really, she is like so mad that she's embarrassed her. Okay, so while Snow is at school, the queen, the evil queen is just going to come and pay the bills. And the bills are 10,000 simoleons, which has made the queen pretty mad. So I think when snow white comes home from school the queen is probably gonna send her out collecting stuff getting her some money because her money has just gone down by 10 grand and she is not happy so yeah i think that's what snow white is gonna be doing today after school so it's a good job she's getting some sleep in class because her energy is quite low and also while snow is at school i think <laughs> the queen's just having herself a drink there um, I think we'll get her to, she wants to 
work on her magical powers. So we'll get her to practice untamed magic. Looks like she's coming outside to practice her magic. Oh, evil has learned all possible spells for their current rank. Practicing magic or experimenting on the cauldron will continue to improve her spellcaster prowess. Okay, so what she needs to do is practice mischief magic instead. Okay, Snow is done with school for the day. Yay, we can play her now. <laughs> oh, and Evil has discovered a new spell, Furio. So let's take a look. So she's discovered a how to convince two sims to argue and fight with each other. Oh my gosh, the spells she's learning it is no good for us. Okay, so it looks like Snow's doing some cooking here. She's probably hungry. Yeah, bless Snow, she has served up a whole meal here. And she's just cleaning up her plates. And I think the evil queen here is just telling Snow that she wants her to go out and collect stuff for her because she had to pay 10 grand in bills. And I think she's saying it's not like you contribute anything. Even though it is Snow that always goes out and collects things for them so they do have money. But regardless anyway i think snow just wants a peaceful life so she's gonna head on out and try and find some stuff for the queen and i think we're gonna send her to henford on bagley if we just land here and then we can take a look around in the area okay so here we are in henford on bagley there is a little baby toddler here i don't know who this toddler is but he's super cute so Snow White is just finding a bench to go and sit on because right now she is feeling super, super sad. It says she's feeling hurt from feeling hurt by someone nearby. And that is because she was with her evil stepmother and she again was rude, nasty, mean to her and demanded her to go out and collect things that they can make money from. But you know, the tone she says things and the way she says things it's really really hurtful for Snow White so let's take a look around and see if we can grab anything to appease the evil queen oh there is a little fox here but it's actually a rabbit or a bird that we need to make friends with for our aspiration oh my gosh guys I can't see anything around and at this ray is gonna make the evil queen super mad because we're gonna go home empty handed after she just spent 10 grand on the bills today. Hello, what is that? Is that a little rabbit hole thing? Is there something here we can make friends with? Oh, admire, talk about music. She likes to sing, socialize, show dance move. <laughs> Although she can't really dance. Let's see if these birds love us. We are Snow White. Come on, birdies. You've got to love us. Uh, and she's really going to need to pee soon. Here she comes. She's going to hopefully make friends with these birdies. Okay, now she's talking to them about music. Oh, flying away. <laughs> now she's admiring them again. Is she making friends with them? Now she's going to discuss the dangers of migration. It's very important stuff. Is she, can she make friends with these birds? Like, are they her friends? Yes. Oh, and I think because the birds are asleep now, she can't socialise with them. Which is a shame, but she's made a start, look. They're acquaintances. They'll be besties in no time. Okay, I think we're just gonna get Snow to head home now because she just keeps falling asleep on the bench. She's knackered. Oh my God, the evil queen is so angry, but it's because she's on her period. <laughs> When Snow White gets home, she can just hide from the evil queen because she's already really angry. And the fact that Snow White is coming home with nothing, I mean, that's not gonna go down well, is it? Okay, so I think we're gonna get Snow to sneak in here and take a shower. Then she is really tired, so we should send her to bed, but this place is getting filthy. Look, there's a dust bunny over here and the queen sees that she's gonna be even madder than what she is right now snow's just sneaking past the queen while she's watching tv quick snow before she sees you good 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 yeah the queen is very distracted right now but we don't know how long that is gonna last oh no snow has just gone to eat her food right in front of the queen what a silly mistake i think the queen is probably gonna ask snow you know what did you get for me She's like, did you get me anything? 
but then when I think Snow drops the news that actually she doesn't have any crystals or anything for her yeah I think the Queen has completely changed her tune and she is being really mean to Snow right now and I think Snow White is just gonna be like look there was nothing there I couldn't get anything I couldn't find anything and I think the Queen would say well why were you there for so long then I mean look at the time I think so like, because I was looking and looking and looking but I couldn't find anything and the Queen's like that is not good enough young lady and Snow's like I'm really sorry I'll try for you tomorrow <gasps> Oh my god, the queen is not having any of it. She's putting a nasty spell on Snow again. Oh my god, what did she do? Oh, Snow is a very sad, sudden despair. A wave of sadness washes over Snow for no apparent reason. Oh, that was so mean. I think that's really, really upset Snow. And yeah, she's just going to go ahead and go to sleep now. And the queen just really doesn't care. <laughs> She's so proud of herself for hurting Snow's feelings. Their sentiments are bad. Yeah, so I think that has upset Snow here so much. She is literally crying in her sleep. The poor girl. Oh, let's take a look. She has got nine days until she ages up and can run away. Um, if the queen carries on like this though, we might have her run away early and she would then become a teen runaway but yeah i don't know how long snow is going to be able to take this for the queen was very mean today so we'll see we don't know we don't know thank you guys so much for watching episode two of the disney princess challenge the snow white generation if you guys are enjoying this series then don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss another episode and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye!